Polycystic ovary syndrome, or PCOS, is a long-term metabolic condition characterized by elevated androgen levels such as testosterone, irregular or absent menstrual periods, and cysts in the ovaries. A diagnosis of PCOS can be confirmed by two out of three criteria after exclusion of other causes. Androgens are responsible for developing the male characteristics seen at puberty, such as facial hair and muscle development. Although androgens are produced by everyone, their level is usually significantly higher in men than women. It is the high level of androgens that results in the symptoms commonly seen in PCOS. PCOS has been traditionally perceived primarily as a reproductive disorder. However, recent studies show that PCOS is associated with increased risk of developing diabetes, fatty liver disease and cardiovascular disorders. PCOS can have many effects on various areas of the body, including your skin health, weight, fertility and mental health. In this video, we will discuss the effects of PCOS on the skin. Firstly, women with PCOS are prone to develop acne and spots. High testosterone increases the activity of oil glands. This can lead to shiny or greasy looking skin of the face, scalp, chest and back, where most oil glands are located. Acnes are particularly seen around the chin and the mouth. Oily skin increases the chances of developing spots and acne when pores are clogged. Some acne can be treated with good skincare regimen, including cleansing the skin twice a day. If acne persists, you can visit your doctor as they might be able to provide you with creams or tablets to help clear up your skin and avoid permanent scarring. Some women with PCOS also experience excess growth of hair in uncommon areas for a woman. PCOS can lead to thick and pigmented hair developing in areas such as the face, neck, chest, stomach, back or buttocks. Many options are available to remove these excess growths of hair if desired. This includes bleaching, shaving, waxing and epilating. For a more long-lasting solution, Laser therapy or electrolysis can be used to remove the hair by destroying its root. However, this can be expensive. Your doctor might also prescribe you medicines to help reduce hair growth if necessary. On the other hand, some women with PCOS experience hair loss. This may result from hair falling out more frequently or just becoming thinner. Your doctor might prescribe you a solution to apply to the scalp to stimulate hair growth or prescribe you some tablets. Alternatively, some women prefer to disguise their hair loss via hairstyling camouflage, such as coloured hairsprays or hair pieces. PCOS can also cause the development of patches of skin known as acanthosis nigricans. These are dark velvety plaques on the skin, usually in the armpit, neck or groin, which feel velvety to touch. Acanthosis nigricans is harmless in of itself, however, some people are concerned by its appearance. It is associated not only with PCOS, but also with being overweight or living with obesity and having diabetes. Therefore, losing weight and getting diabetes under control is the mainstay of treatment and should result in their appearance fading over time. For more information about PCOS, you can visit the resources provided by various patient support groups linked in the description. Thank you for watching.